What's up? Space Monkey here, and welcome back to another Call of Duty Weapons. And today we're on Call of Duty World War II, and we're going to talk about the Gavar 43. The Gavar 43 is actually a very decent semi automatic assault rifle. These are the variants that I have um, as of right now in the game. I would like to find the uh, Nobel 2 and get my hands on that one. Um, the Chiller. Not sure when I'll be able to get the chance to get that one, seeing how that's a part of a collection that's uh, way past due. This is the inspection of the variants that I have of this weapon. Now, this weapon does have a very high fire rate for being a uh, semi-automatic. It's very surprising to play with. Uh, you know, it's definitely one of those weapons you want to give a try and decide for yourself um, on how you like this weapon. This is the uh, regular base variant of the Gewehr 43. Uh, you know, sometimes in the uh, weapon challenges, uh, they'll have basic variants of uh, certain weapons in the game that you're able to go and get you those uh, headshots to earn. Of course, they're going to cost you some of those uh, armory credits uh, to activate that challenge, but. Uh, if you happen to see a weapon that you want, it's definitely worth giving it a try. As far as uh, bloodthirsty triple kills and double kills, this weapon definitely pulls through on, on uh, bloodthirsties and things of that nature. So it definitely goes on the list of all the other weapons that I've able to uh, pull off and get bloodthirsties with. And of course, you named it. I got it on this map here. Everybody knows about shipment already if you've been playing the game. Shipment is a map that is very chaotic and known to have plenty of targets to shoot at. Of course, you have to watch out for those guys out there that are running with ordnance or uh, requisitions. You know, uh, a lot of score streaks are going on on this map. Uh, but it's definitely still a fun map to play with, seeing how it's been in some of the other previous Call of Duty games. So for me, it's, it's like a, just basically like a remake, you know. Just like most of you guys that are Call of Duty veterans out there. Um, as far as gameplay goes with this weapon, it definitely pulls through. And it has no trouble going up against uh, those trigger happy players out there that like to spray and pray. You know, the submachine gun guys and the LMG guys and the uh, rest of the opponents that you're going up against that just like to uh, blind fire and shoot through walls and things like that. This is definitely a weapon out there that you don't want to miss out on giving it, at least giving it one try before you decide to uh, not play with it any, any longer. I know that there's other weapons in the game that are a lot better than this weapon, but if you want to get the uh, full experience, try to play with different variants, different weapons, uh, you know, just to get your feel on what your favorite weapon would be and what game mode you want to use these weapons in. As far as uh, semi-automatic type weapons, I like to go into uh, hardcore mode. Uh, you know, of course, you get that one-shot kill, which definitely makes up for it when you're playing with, in core mode, you know, because, of course, like I say again, you're going against a lot of trigger-happy people. And in hardcore mode, at least it gives you a chance to uh, put a dent in that scoreboard and definitely take down some of the opposing players. You know, just represent. Let them know you're there. But like I said before, the Gavar 43 is definitely a weapon for you guys to give a chance to play with. Uh, it plays very well in Domination and other game modes like that as far as offensively and defensively. You know, it has uh, various types of attachments, just like all the other weapons in the game that you can uh, slap on it. Um, but, once again, thanks for watching. Don't forget to smash that like button on the way out, and don't forget to subscribe. There is more content on the way. And uh, today's weapon is the Gavar 43. So hope you guys enjoyed today's gameplay, and uh, until next time, this is Space Monkey, signing out. Peace. Care package on the way. Protect the drop zone. Ah!